today, I am nominating Mary Jo White to lead the Security and Exchange Commission and Richard Cordray to continue leading the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau. Uh, this guy's bothering me here. As a young girl, Mary Jo White was a big fan of the Hardy Boys. I, I was too, by the way. Good, good. Yeah. Um, as an adult, she's built a career the Hardy Boys could only dream of. Uh, over a decade as a U.S. attorney in New York, she helped prosecute white-collar criminals and money launderers. In the early 1990s, she brought down John Gotti, the head of the Gambino Crime Syndicate, and she brought to justice the terrorists responsible for bombing the World Trade Center and the American embassies in Africa. So I'd say that's a pretty good run. You don't want to mess with Mary Jo. Uh, as one former SEC chairman said, Mary Jo does not intimidate easily. And that's important because she has a big job ahead of her. My second nominee is a familiar face. A year and a half ago, I nominated Richard Cordray to lead the watchdog agency we created to give Americans the information they need to make sound financial choices and protect them from unscrupulous lenders and debt collectors. Uh, as a former Attorney General of Ohio with a long record of working with Democrats and Republicans on behalf of the American people, Nobody questioned Richard's qualifications, but he wasn't allowed an up or down vote in the Senate. And I, as a consequence, I took action to appoint him on my own. And over the last year, Richard has proved to be a champion of American consumers.